morning. I'm Mike Violette with EspressoEngineering.tv, and I'm very pleased to be at the 2012 IEEE EMC Symposium in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. I'm here with Andy Drozd. Andy, welcome. Hi, Mike. Thanks How are you doing? Good, Andy thanks. is uh, president of Andrew Computation. He's the immediate past president, or the past president of the EMC Society, yes. and, and this year's exhibits chair. So, Andy, yes. Andy, how's the show going so far? Actually, the show is going very well right now. We have a number of activities going on, as you know, during the symposium with the technical sessions, the opening sessions, uh, the exhibits, uh, other things that are going on, including the demonstrations. So we start right immediately at the starting block with lots of activity and lots of things going on. So it's going very well. Yes, uh, yesterday was uh, workshops and tutorials primarily. Yes. So a great way to open the week up with fundamentals of EMC. You got it, yep. Um, can you talk a little bit about some of the folks that are presenting at the show this year? Well, uh, the, all of the usual uh, very well-known people, world-renowned uh, experts, a um, number of people who have worked in the EMC business for over 30 years, are giving presentations, tutorials. We have workshops at the end of the week as well. Um, these are all being conducted by uh, pretty much everybody who's everybody in the EMC business. We don't like to use oh. the term old hands, so they're ex experienced uh, professionals. Experienced like professionals, right. yeah, and I don't like to name drop one or two, but we have just about everybody here that you want to meet that's an expert in EMC, a veteran, people who know their, their business. So. And you're the exhibits chair, so you've yes. got a, a lot of loyalty built into the exhibit hall Absolutely, here, and this yeah. is demonstrated. You've got uh, folks that have been with the society for years and years, so and I'm sure you appreciate their patronage. Absolutely. Uh, if it's been a team effort, we always count on these people year to year. I've been doing the exhibits for two years now. I've also helped in the background and other symposia. So it's a team effort. I like working with the people that we have on our staff. Uh, next year, who knows, in years to come, if I'm involved again in the exhibits and beyond, that would be great. Well, next uh, year is the Mile High City. I yep, understand. Denver so, next year, yeah, so we're looking forward to that. Yeah. And it, In fact, uh, every year while you're doing the current year, you're always thinking about next year and who's going to be taking over and how you need to impart that knowledge and wisdom to them. So, uh, yeah, it's fun. It's fun. On this show, you've held a variety of roles. I know you did the experiments <laughs> for a number of years, which yeah. were tremendously successful, and they're in the hall this yep, year as well. Right so, down the way here, right? so we've got a lot of practical stuff to show you. So yep. uh, welcome to the show, uh, uh, Andy. Thank you we very really much. appreciate your, your help. And what is the EMC Society looking to accomplish in the near future? I think what we're trying to do more of is uh, become more and more relevant. Not that we're irrelevant, don't get me wrong. I think what we need to do is show how EMC fits into just about every technology on the planet. Seriously. And it's uh, an effort right now to try to match our technology and our capabilities into some of these new markets and areas that we're not traditionally part of. So that's always been at the forefront. I've been pushing that when I was president of the society, and people who have followed me are trying to do the same. So you'll see the expansion of technical committees. You'll see uh, new committees being formed that are kind of at their forefront. Uh, Nanotechnology uh, is a great example. Addressing things like nanotechnology, exactly, smart yeah. grid. Smart grid is a perfect and example. Of course, yeah. your uh, forte is computational yep. uh, uh, electrodynamics, if you might call Le it's it. It's electromagnetics, right? Electromagnetics. Yeah. And so that that is. Uh, there's a lot of simulation being done in yep. this, in, within our society, our community. Absolutely. And just one last point is that when we get into uh, measurement and testing, those are absolutely needed. What we're trying to do is bring uh, simulation technology to help that out because it's getting expensive to do a lot of the measurements and tests. So hey, don't take away all the testing. No, no, okay. no, no. All Actually, right. we're trying to make it more important and focus it. So that's really kind of our, our forte and our goal for the future. So. Well, thanks, Andy. I appreciate you coming on Espresso Thank Engineering. You. This is Mike Violette. We're here at the 2012 IEEE EMC Symposium Pittsburgh.